What's good? I'm Tech with Corey, and today let's talk about vlogging. That's right, vlogging. The super easy way to vlog is to vlog with your iPhone. You always got it on you, so it's the simplest camera to use, and it's actually a great camera to use. And with the iPhone 15, you can now uh, shoot in log mode. So I got my iPhone 15 Pro here, and when you want to vlog, you know the standard vlog is you put, put the phone up, and boom, you look at the front of the camera. Well, the front camera isn't the greatest camera, so you kind of get limited on how you can shoot with it. So with the log features, you get the best footage out of shooting from the back. So when you do the, the backwards way and you put your camera up and you're trying to look at the camera or if, no matter the way you hold it, if you're gonna have a camera at the top or at the bottom, so you're holding your phone up and you're trying to look at the camera to make sure you're all actually in focus, in frame and all that type of stuff. So it makes it super hard when it comes to try to vlog. So been trying to figure out all different kinds of options to make that work out for me because I have a tough time staying in frame and being in focus and just making sure I got the right shot. So lo and behold, Amazon's always the answer. So I go on Amazon and I find this vlog monitor by uh, Numoa and here we go. So here's what I got here. I got three pieces. I got a Bluetooth remote here. It works up it, the 30, 33 feet is what they say it works up to. So you got a Bluetooth remote you actually have a great phone holder, but the phone holder here has a magnetic piece in the back. It has a cold shoot and it has a uh, mounting at the bottom. So you can mount this on the tripod, mount it however you want to mount it. So boom, that's that. Now here's the actual monitor that you get. So you get this monitor, super simple and easy to use. So you turn the monitor on, it's self-explanatory on the screen, it's telling you what to do. So it says you go to the Wi-Fi on your phone. So now you got your phone in front of you, just want to go to the Wi-Fi, boom. So. Wi-Fi tells you you connect to the name it has and it has the password in it. So you got it. all the information that's just two easy quick steps. So you go to your Wi-Fi, you select the name and let's do it. So as we select and get to the Wi-Fi, I'll actually set that up and I put my phone actually in the holder. So phone's in the holder. Boom. It all makes sense. It fits in any kind of case. You can adjust it and it has, like I said, it has the cold shoe at the bottom. It has the mount at the bottom. So you can mount it on the tripod or however you want to do it. But everything is there. So now that I'm connected, it shows you right here you're connected. So check once connected. Next, all you do on your phone is you go to the actual mirror settings on your phone. So it's a quick, you probably already noticed that, just a quick drop down. You hit the double uh, icons there and it shows you which one you want to use. You just click that and now you can actually mirror. So as it does that, it's gonna actually pull it up here. It's gonna connect. And once it connects, you'll see it pop up in a second where you now have both. As you can see right there, we have the mirroring mode is set up. So with the mirror mode, we're all set. So all we need to do now is actually select our camera and boom, when we select our camera, go to video. And with my phone here, I'm just gonna show you here, I have a, a small um, drive, a Samsung uh, flash drive that can let me shoot in log mode. So I just put that in right there. Let me adjust my settings real quick and go in log mode. So once I go in log mode, you can see the screen is great. Now see, now you're getting all the features of the log mode. So all I need to do now, what this does here with the uh, MOA is magnetic. So it just fits right in the place. So you can now see what you're doing. So as you can see right there, I can see what I'm doing. So I'm gonna turn around and actually show you how I actually use this. So I got it here. Let me put it up, up right side up. So when I turn around here, now I can actually vlog and I've got this backwards here so I can see. And as you can see, I got myself in frame so I can easily shoot the footage and show myself actually shooting. So now you can see my behind the scenes set up. So if I wanted to use this remote, all I have to do with the remote is hit play and then boom, turn the remote on, on off switch. And then boom, now I can record. I'm recording right there. And all I got to do, I can look at the camera. I got everything right here in the frame so I can see myself as I actually move around. So this is game changing when you can see yourself and you no longer have to worry about it. So imagine in the past, this wasn't all. You're trying to look at the camera to see if you're in the frame and everything of that nature. So now you don't have to worry about that. All you have to do, boom, put that on. You can actually see yourself and see that you're in the frame. So. This right here, game changer for me, is the new MOA uh, vlog. It's called a vlog monitor, but it works really well. It works remotely too, so even if you didn't want to use that back there, on there you can just have it wherever you just want to see yourself for a second monitor. But instead of using a front camera, 
And instead of trying to look at the camera from the backside, I don't have to now do that. All I have to do is put this on. It's magnetic. It stays in the place very easy. And that's all you're doing. It's on there. It's showing you. So game changer for me. I can now shoot in log mode. It has a remote. I can mount this on my tripod. I can mount it on whatever I want to mount it on. But it works super great. I've been using it. Creating some great dope content. So if you're looking for a way to, to monitor yourself to make sure you're in frame, stay in the focus, check out the new MOA Vlog Monitor.